Dubai, United Arab Emirates, Iran's parliamentary speaker warned Sunday that protests over the death of a young woman in police custody could destabilize the country and urged security forces to deal harshly with those he claimed endanger public order. Mohammed Bagar Kalabov told lawmakers that unlike the current protests, which he said aimed to topple the government, previous demonstrations by teachers and retirees over pay were aimed at reforms, according to the legislative Bodice website. The important point of the past protests was that they I ask all who have any reasons to protest not to allow their protest to turn into destabilizing and toppling of institutions. Thousands of Iranians have taken to the streets over the last two weeks to protest the death of Masa Amini, a 22-year-old woman who had been detained by Iran's morality police in the capital of Tehran for allegedly not adhering to Iran's strict Islamic dress code. The protesters have vented their anger over the treatment of women and wider repression in the Islamic Republic. The nationwide demonstrations rapidly escalated into calls for the overthrow of the clerical establishment that has ruled Iran since its 1979 Islamic Revolution. More, how protests in Iran over Masa Amini's death forever moved the debate over women's rights The protests have drawn supporters from various ethnic groups, including Kurdish opposition movements in the northwest of Iran that operate along the border with neighboring Iraq. Amini was an Iranian Kurd and the protests first erupted in Kurdish areas. Iranian state TV has reported that at least 41 protesters and police have been killed since the demonstrations began September 17. An Associated Press count of official statements by authorities tallied at least 14 dead, with more than 1, 500 demonstrators arrested. Opinion, Iran's Gen Z is fed up. The protests aren't just about hijab. They're about regime change. Kalabov, the parliamentary speaker, is a former influential commander in the paramilitary Islamic Revolutionary Guard. Along with the president and the head of the judiciary, he is one of three ranking officials who deal with all important issues of the nation. The three meet regularly and sometimes meet with Supreme Leader Ayatollah Ali Khamenei who has final say on all state matters. Kalibov said he believes many of those taking part in recent protests had no intention of seeking to overthrow the government in the beginning and claimed foreign-based opposition groups were fomenting protests aimed at tearing down the system. Iranian authorities have not presented evidence for their allegations of foreign involvement in the protests. Creating chaos in the streets will weaken social integrity, jeopardizing the economy while increasing pressure and sanctions by the enemy, he said, referring to long-standing crippling you.